First on 11 Alive, a tragic update as a beloved Metro Atlanta bookstore owner is found dead. Her own employee now charged with killing her. Our Bo Beth Yates is following the case. She reports from Locust Grove with brand new details tonight. Flowers now sit in front of Birdsong Books as part of a memorial for the owner after her body was discovered floating in a creek. I still have this sick feeling in my stomach, in my head. I just keep thinking about her. Shauna Moa is referring to Dr. Erica Atkins, the Locust Grove resident and business owner whose body was discovered in Cedar Creek, close to Jones and Putnam County lines. It just floored me, basically. It floored me beyond measure. I was just completely devastated. Amoa says Atkins, who owned Birdsong Books, was reported missing Saturday. And Jones County Sheriff's Office said someone fishing discovered her body in the water Sunday and called the police. Officials have since arrested 38-year-old Romero Johnson for murder and kidnapping. He is said to have been a friend and worked for Atkins at her bookstore. I instantly assumed it was someone she knew. So shocked, yes, um, oblivious, even more. And those who knew Atkins say she will be missed. Erica was a busy woman. She was committed to helping her community. She donated books, donated her time. In fact, she came last year to my summer camp and read to my kids, donated her time there. Erica was just a pillar in our community. She just won a National Small Business of the Year through the Chamber of Commerce. We really, really will miss Erica. It's devastating to us out here in Henry County. Tonight, we spoke to the Henry County jail officials who tell us Johnson remains in jail, charged with murder and kidnapping, and will likely not be getting bond. Bo Beth Yates, 11 Alive News.